Boy, that devil know he be busy, man. I'm like, I'm like, seriously though, like, you know what I'm saying? If you of a certain stature, of a certain demeanor, trying to do positive things and take care of your family and live on a, a exclusive level and just handle all the business that you're supposed to handle, the devil going to come at you, bro, in all different kind of ways. And today we got a story about uh, T.I. and Trey the Truth. Some comedian ran up on him, quote unquote, doing a prank. But I don't even look at this as a prank. I look at this as a, a measuring tool. Let's see how far I can take it with these successful rappers. Let's see, can I get away with using this word and just get out, you know what I'm saying, without any repercussions by when I just run up on him and use the word. But when I look at it from the rapper's perspective, I can't do nothing but respect the way that they handled the situation because there's so much that's on the line. There's so many different people that's depending on these people to, these, these guys to make a way and a path and a future for them that they can't just throw it all away over somebody little fake ass viral prank. But I'm going to um, get into this story right here, man. I'm going to read the story a little bit farther down. They got the video. So I'll play the video for you. Then I'll come back with the rest of my commentary. We'll get out of here. T.I. and Trey the Truth targeted for racist prank and it goes badly. The rap bosses responded to being called a racially charged name. A white comedian, and I'm not going to call his name on my video. Yeah, a white comedian trying to pull off a viral prank on rappers T.I. and Trey the Truth nearly got his scalp peeled off his skull when he walked up and called the crew boy. Tilp and Trey were hanging out at the top of a parking deck with a, a group of that included King Harris and some more people. In an undisclosed location, that's when the social media comedian prankster, not calling his name, happened up on the scene. This guy, who I'm not going to call his name, was outfitted in stereotypical redneck attire, replete with blue overalls, a straw hat, as that comedian, who I'm not going to call his name, within... Uh, got in within proximity of the ground hustle and ABN bosses. He barked out. He barked at a black photographer to shut it. Shut what he said to uh to shut his camera off and completed the order with the word boy. So that's something that if if you I don't even know I can I can speak on the district that I'm from and the region that I'm from I'm from the south. And if you you know what I'm saying that's something that they still do right here to this 2023. You, they'll, they'll hit you with that boy just to see if you're going to have a, a flinch or a reaction. Uh, it, me, I'm on top telling you, hey, just, hey man, listen, we both grown men. So approach me as a grown man, and I'm going to approach you as a grown man. I'm not finna sit up and be nobody, boy. You're not finna call me that. It just, that's just not, you know what I'm saying, a part of who I am. For to Just let, me, let you sit up and knowingly, knowing that you disrespected me, saying some highly offensive names toward me. I'm not, we're not finna do that, bro. We're gonna trade them. We're gonna trade them back and forth. I can it's some it's some, it's some words that you can be called to that I'm gonna choose to not put on my video right now. And they definitely not words that's in my regular vocabulary. But if you coming at me aggressively with the boy, I got some I got some defense tactics that I can, you know what I'm saying, depend on. Let's see, it says uh the comedian. Turned to the crew with the question and nearly uh that nearly sealed his fate. Hey, what are you guys doing here, boy? He asked the, the group aggressively with his voice and a thick, contrived uh southern draw. And here go the video. I'm gonna go and play the video for you. Oh, it, well, this what this did trade the truth posting it. And you know what I'm saying? I'm, and I'll get to that part. I'll say that later on. So I got it. Yeah, just, just, just stay tuned. Boy, I be trying to trade, trade, trade the truth. I get this a tweet. Boy, I be trying to mind my business, and here I come, and here come a damn prank. He almost got the reaction he was looking for. Tilt made, and tilt made me make sure I was cool. You, you tag. See, he got, he did. I would, I would not have be tagging him. That made me suspicious. Like, was it a prank inside of a prank? 
Did I get pranked for even reporting this? But I ain't even want to go down that road though. But woo, that's that's just something that I'm dealing with right here in this moment. Like anyway, but I, he wouldn't be tagged on my video because you try you try to make me act out of character. But anyway, they tagged him so. His name right there. If I, if you ain't caught his name yet, his name right there in the video. And I'm gonna go ahead and play this um this video right here, so we can so we can see exactly what happened or a little clip of what happened. See, man, I'm trying. I'm, 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 I gotta keep it the book with how I feel about the situation too. Now, I don't know these people, and I, you know, what I'm saying I don't know none of them personally. I always been a fan of Ti. Try the truth, I, I, I'm, I'm not really very familiar with him. No disrespect to the brother, but it did seem that seemed a little contrived right there at the end. Even though I, it, I felt, I felt like some realness about it, but at the end, I felt a little bit of. A little comic relief in there too, and I guess I don't know. Maybe that was that that just Ti slick with it, humor character, fast on the spot with it. I give him that. Ti is a witty guy, so I'm not gonna go ahead and put that on a jacket. But damn it, confused me a little bit at the end right there. But I definitely wouldn't have him tagged in my post. I ain't that friendly like that. And, but you know who I can't. I'm I'm gonna let these guys be who they are. I don't expect everybody to handle every situation exactly like I would handle it. But he wouldn't get no love, no boost, no acclaim off of my name. Not when he tried to go viral on me like that. Came up and called me a boy. Even though, okay, it was a prank. But in my brain, it ain't no prank. It's a test. See, can I get away with this? Let me see how they feel about this. Maybe it's a, it's a, it's a meter for whoever stumbled across this video and say, hey, did what we doing now. So now, so now you got, so now the pranksters, they ran out of, the pranks already were borderline risque the whole time. Now you going to, to the racial pranks. So somebody going to get hurt, bro. But the thing about it, when I hurt you for doing a racial prank, I'm still going to end up behind the wall for that. So is that what I'm saying? I really don't, don't agree with none of this stuff right here. Boy, I ain't nobody, back to the story. Boy, I ain't nobody, boy, Trey retorted angrily and triggered by the racially charged word. T.I. kept cool by calling the man Bob the Builder. Yeah, a good little comic relief. A friend of Trey's wasn't having any snatching. Yeah, we saw all that. We, I saw that basically the rest of the story just detailing what happened. And we just saw what happened and we just talked about what happened. And I just don't, you know, I don't like it. I don't like it, but it's the world that we live in. Everybody pushing the line. Everybody seeing how far they can go, what they can get away with. All I can say is be careful. Be careful with the way you're moving around out there and, and, and take take caution. Ask around. Mr. Pranksters, this to all the pranksters out there, ask around, man. See, Understand where you at and who you around because some of these people ain't playing these type of game, man. A lot of people ain't playing these games like this, bro. So just be careful with it. I enjoy a good laugh and a good prank, a good one, a good clean one. But when you go to pushing so many lines, it just go across the line and overboard. Then, you know, I, I got to get off track with that. But anyway, I'm going to leave that right there. I'm going to leave that right there. It's your boy, man. Ocean, man. I appreciate you if you made it before I drop a 100 in the chat. That would be, <laughs> let's see what kind of word. I'm going to come up with a word. That would be audacious. I don't know if there's no word. That will be. That'll be terrific and amazing if you um you know like subscribe and share my videos and stuff like that. It's your boy, man. Come back again. We'll do this again. Your boy is out.